This is Alan Hayes. He's known really? as the gadget guy. Yeah, you betcha. You still do your gadget talk? I love to, yeah. Wow. I go all over the place. I remember that. That was great. Cool, yeah. I so if you want people to come and talk about gadgets, you can call up Alan Hayes. That's me. What do you think, Alan? You Quick, think Alan, we need to do much I'm mouth still, to, I'm, I'm I mean, did we, did, we, did we do too much CO2? Mouth to spirit I don't hole. know if you follow directions or we follow in protocol. Yeah, so actually, we are not following protocol. 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 You didn't go over four seconds. No. You did an initial burst, and then they're coming back. They, it does take them a little while. I've, I've anesthetized bees before. It helps to put them in the sun too, kind of warm them up. Let's see. Yeah, we got twitching. See the one up on top? He's this twitch one? She's twitching, yeah. She's twitching. Oh, yeah. We just need to perform mouth to mouth. Mouth to spherical. Mouth to mandible. It'll breathe through oh. their mouths, though. That's true. Mouth to spherical. You have to put your mouth around the abdomen and blow. Would you demonstrate that for us, please? Sure. <gasps> I'm afraid I can. Hey guys, what's up? David Burns here for another exciting video on beekeeping. Thanks for joining me. Got a lot of fun stuff today. Uh, those bees made it fine. Don't worry about them. They all came back after a little abdomen to mouth resuscitation. Hey, the bees are all good. We did a little experimenting, putting them to sleep and testing and it's, it's all good. Uh, today I want to do a little experimenting with some honey. I was invited to be a vendor at the University of Illinois Beekeeping Short Course this year and had the privilege of tasting some of that fine honey that they always gather up from all over the world. So let me tell you what it tastes like. So I'm gonna, I've got all these different honeys here that I'm gonna taste test. Uh, they have pretzels here. Don't need a pretzel. But I'm gonna need spoons. You know, I have a whole bunch of spoons ready. Okay, here we go. Black locust. Black locust, one of my favorites. It's hard to get black locust. Rosemary from France. You too. Thank you very much. You're very good. What's what? From China. Ooh, it's running. Wow. Wow. Don't like that too much. Here's Linden. Oh, that's what I like. I think I like this kind. Nah. Sugar gum is my all-time favorite. Sugar gum, it's thick. It has a I think it has a buttery taste. Over 25 or should I go down to Um, I usually take 50 Oh no, Cat Claw. Cat Claw is my favorite. Yeah. It's from Mexico and it's really thick. Cat Claw is it. It was a model. Oh yeah. That's a buttery taste. Christmas berry from Hawaii. Christmas berry from Hawaii. Ooh! Tastes like medication. Yeah, there's a whole set. You get to come too. How do you do from Tish? New Zealand? Is the best way to go to St. Louis 57? Yeah, 57 South. 57 South Avenue. Not my favorite. Log, 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 Longan? L O N G A N from Taiwan. <laughs> oh, I like it. The last one is my favorite buckwheat from Wisconsin. Really black, and some people just don't like it. Now I need an insulin shot. Uh, I've got sugar high. 
Wow, I don't know if I ever want to eat honey again. Oh, that was great. Some of that honey really tasted good. Hey, thanks for joining me today. I really appreciate it. Be sure and subscribe below. We love to have more subscribers on our beekeeping video YouTube channel. Tell your friends. Think what would have happened had you not happened to come across this video. You would have missed out on so many cool things. Let your buddies and friends and beekeeping clubs know about our YouTube channel on beekeeping. We'll see you next time. Here is a swarm of bees at the top of this pine tree. There's David Burns in the background completely ignoring everything. <laughs>